Yo, what's up guys, how's it going? Welcome to the vlog. Today is gonna be a really exciting and productive day, man. Productive day. Goals for the day. Stream. We're gonna stream. Second goal for today, study. Two hours. Third goal for the day, I have a meeting with uh, Ben CB from Razor Edge, which is a new training site, so I'm really looking forward to talking with him. Fourth goal, exercise of some sort. Goal number five, my tax return, sign it, scan it, send it via email. Those are the goals. Bunch of bonuses. I don't even know them in my head, and I'm not thinking about them because it's too complex and just like, ugh. It just hurts my brain thinking about all the other things. So I'm not gonna do that. Um, stream starting up soon. Have a great day. Yeah, 123.2. Good morning. Uh, can I have an Americano, please? Yeah. Can I get a yeah. latte, please? Latte. Okay. It's 158 pounds. It's 22 it's pounds away. 159. I still have 91 to go. 91 pounds off that body. Yeah, dude. So when you're doing your goals, you can be like, oh, all this weight's coming off me. I have to think about putting 25 pounds on me. Let's pick up a 25 dumb, pound dumbbell and put that on. Yeah. Walk around with that. Dude, I know. You're a slow build, though, for that. Yeah. Mine's a fast build. Yeah, it's a drastic change in a short amount of time. All right, so here's the thing. Been four days. We haven't booked the Croatia house, so I'm assuming we're going home now. No, I don't care if we go back right now. Like, where are we going to go? Toronto, Vancouver. Toronto, Vancouver, Victoria, Quebec City, Ottawa. I feel it's pretty cool. Some good vlog spots. Ottawa, there's the river, or the canal, Port Parliament, yeah. there's things to do. If I, yeah, if I didn't have Somewhere to worry crazy. about the group or anything, then I would just post up in, probably in like London or Ireland, until Barcelona, and then I'd go from Barcelona <laughs> to the Virgin Islands. Here's the reasons why I wanna, I would like to go. Here's okay. the reasons. One, financially right now, I'm pretty low. To be in a spot where I'm not busy, I'm not facing complications, I don't have to pay rent or for food. It just, it, it allows me to make more money than I would in another spot, right? Two, like, just like, just a slight mental reset. Yep. It's just kind of hard to explain, but it exists. Yeah. You know, just like a mental reset from all the traveling and stress over the last few years even. It's just been a lot. Yeah. And just like a few creature comforts. Cause like I know we got we got Streambo and then is the other place public? It's, it's not public yet, but we have another project. Yeah, Streambo and then another project. Till the end of December. So those are the reasons why like banging out two months at home with my DX race friends <laughs> looks good to me. We're going to the British Virgin Islands like at the end of August. Until late September. We'll be there for a while. Yeah, quite a while. Crazy. Yeah, what, a, nuts, what a crazy spot to post up. It's such a beautiful place. It's it. a it's a wallpaper. The whole thing's a wallpaper at every yeah. spot. Yes. yes. White white sand, perfect beach, perfect weather. I mean, part of the wallpaperness is when Bill takes you to like a private rock island. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you can look out. And yeah. It'd be a very different experience without a without a boat. <laughs> oh yeah. But it'd still be epic. If you think about a lot of the stuff we did, we like we boated to somewhere. Yeah, like a lot, like 30 minutes. The pizza boat. I'm gonna get tilted by the pizza boat, dude. I'm already on tilt just thinking about it. Now you'd be running on hype though. Forgot you're a hype man. If you're on the boat and people are like, "Oh my God, Jimmy, your progress!" Holy yeah. shit! You're not gonna be doing pizza. You're not gonna give a shit about pizza boat. We'll be flexing on it. We'll be flexing on it. I'll be literally flexing on it. Yeah. Uh, here. Thank you. If you had to give yourself like a, an honest chance of failure at this point, like in terms of a percentage, if you had to step outside yourself, view it from a third party source, knowing what we know though, and like how we feel. Let's say we fail 13% of the time. If that, 10% maybe. Yeah. Maybe less even. 
I don't I don't think there's any universe in which I don't get to where I want to be. I'm way closer than I should be, yeah. way earlier than I need to be, and I'm like 100% motivated. Like I love going to the gym, and like I'm eating a ton. Like it's working. So I, would I just put it at like 15 or 16 percent. I know Mike's gonna be around like a lot. There's gonna be a lot of Mike time. A lot of Mike. Mm -hmm. um, so. Mike's not gonna let us fail. He just won't let us fail. But you know, there's also a chance that like, we overestimate our ability to get to 180 or 185. Like, wow, my last 20 pounds is gonna be insanely hard. Or like, your last 20 is gonna be insanely hard. There's a chance that happens. See, I think like 5% of the time is like an overjudgment on our ability and we just like fail straight up and then I think the rest of it minus one percent is the day we don't manage to get our weight within one pound yeah and then one percent is like like some crazy event happens that makes the bet irrelevant to us yeah one percent or a less than one percent thing like stuff like that just doesn't happen often enough we need to research an MMA cutting specialist as well like make weight specialist we need to find someone I mean, I know Mike's gonna get good at it. He's obviously super knowledgeable, and I feel like we could do it ourselves, but it's just gonna be such a printy investment to decrease our chance of failure to like insanely low levels by paying for someone's hotel room to come down, you know? So I don't know, it'd be good to check with the vlog if anyone knows of anyone that specializes on making weight, like as a trainer for MMA or used to fight MMA or, or boxing or anything like that, where they had to make a specific weight. This is something else Mike is looking into is scale. I don't want a weak scale. Like, I want to know exactly I'm 0.3 above you. Oh, it said we have to use a doctor scale. Like we should I think so. Like a physical one. Yeah. yeah. Like one of the ones where you... Yeah, where you can tip it like this. Yeah. You know, we'll monitor a lot the two days leading up. Monitor post meals and like... It's tough. Man, this is tough. My maintenance calories are going to be way different. Because it'll just be like, I just went to the bathroom. Like, okay. Let's go get check the scale, boys. Like, where are we at? When was the last time you went to the bathroom? Like, literally, just being super scientific about it. Okay, Matt, you need to eat. Uh, you need to eat 3,800 calories. Jamie, you need to eat 1,400 calories. Like, yeah, it's a lot tougher to match than like we both eat the exact same thing. Yeah, because if I eat that with my mass on my body, like I'll drop. If I got a ton of size on me, then like unnatural amount of size. Like, if I don't keep up with the eating, like I will just lose weight. I can lose water weight though. I mean, we'll get it. Yeah, we will get it. I, it's amazing to me how many people in Twitch chat feel like this is how we're gonna lose. I mean, I give it 8%. That we failed this way and yeah. with the pound. I think it's too high. You might be, it is too high. Yeah, I it mean, it's just like, high. you have unlimited time. We have, we have 275 days get to like where we're even. And then the three days leading up, it's all we have to do. Like, we don't have any job at that point. Checking, monitoring, Matt. Sleeping is sketchy. I don't want to take eight hours out of my time and be like, oh shit, three pounds so far. Wayne's 5 p.m. Let's just wake up at 7 a.m. Like, that, that gives us 10 hours. All right, Jamie, you go on a four-hour hike now. Matt, eat a burger. Or, <laughs> like, eat, eat oh. some dough. Oh, the variance in this bet. Like, one screw up and I just lose 75. Jeez. Off by three decimal points. Just, the thing that scares me the most is that. shoveling 75,000 into the fire if we're off by 0 0.3, 0 0.1, which is like a night and day in terms of quality of life for the next 10 years, because you can turn that money into shit. That's crazy. Yeah, I'm back from the gym. How's your weight in this morning? I weighed in heavy, 72, and that's my highest kilogram by like two kilograms compared to yesterday, it's ridiculous. So, almost up to 160 pounds, which is just insane. I got my post-workout toxic shake here with all kinds of powders and witchcraft in here. Mega-proof powders. Dude, I love the bulk situation you have going up here. Bowl, bowl, bag of chips, that is, <laughs> that is epic, dude. Yes, while eating a shake, God. Such a legend. It's a full-time job, dude. Bulk. Dude, it's I can't. It's a full-time job. <laughs> Get out. Out. Can you put these glasses out. on before I go? Just, just for the swagger. Out. Ah. Out. What a man. Stream live. As I mentioned, 750 deep sec, 11 rebuy, 11 bounty, 27 hyper, and the 44 bounty builder. I'm gonna be coming back in about three minutes. You guys, just gonna grab some water. Checking in with the fan, and uh, we'll be back. Okay, you're watching Poker Simples on Twitch. Stay with me. Yeah, I don't know. I feel I feel like I'm playing really good poker today, and I'm like excited to play today because I did some studying.
and I think made some good improvements. So I feel like I'm gonna win a tournament today. Focus, making good decisions. You on break right now? Uh, yeah, like two more minutes. Cool, cool. Um, how how are things going? A A15 works. If you end up wanting to do early, we're thinking about trying to find a cliff to go cliff jumping. I mean, let's see how let's see how the stream goes. Don't let great be the enemy of good. <laughs> Killing the quote game. There we go, Mike. I mean, I definitely stole that. <laughs> Maddie Ice's micronutrients. <laughs> the bulk boys. Alright, I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, boy. Let's go. Oh, it's just for me. Yeah. <laughs> So from the cliff back home, ran, but my meeting, I was, by the way, I was like five minutes late, so I was like, oh God, stress, my meeting uh, didn't make it, or there's a lack of communication or something. We're rescheduled, so I'm calling that one a win at the end of the day, because I was here, I was ready. It's 8 p.m., I've exercised, I only streamed two hours, we got the taxes done, boom, let's go. Dad is back. <laughs> Don't worry. No, I'm just fidget, fidget light. All right, I'm gonna sleep well. What are you doing for food? I ate already. The pork and the vegetables, we already got that in the vlog. I had a smoothie this morning. I'm gonna hit a smoothie, like, pretty soon, and I'm pretty pumped about it. Pretty excited, too. What else I was gonna say? Oh, yeah, yeah, Instagram. I gotta do Instagram. I haven't posted a photo since this morning. I did. Right now. Yo, what's up, guys? We are done for the day. I wanted to do a quick recap. Today, the Twitch stream, not so good. Yeah, Twitch stream, we did a couple hours, busted a lot. It was really disappointing, man. But, you know, like, I can't go back to the morning and change how I ran or, like, my willingness to continue after things went poorly. So, we'll just keep moving forward. I'll give it a half, because it's about a half time. Thing number two, exercise, definitely hit it. At the cliff jumping, I didn't quite leave enough time to get back to a meeting that ended up being postponed for an hour, so there's no problem. But I did like run back most of it. So that was intense, pretty hype. Got some good exercise in there. Studying was awesome today. Did bonus study of like an extra half an hour. Talking with Ben CB today, uh, who is one of the very best poker players in the world, very best tournament poker players. Um, has crushed it during the biggest tournament series for quite a long time. Um, so I had a good conversation with him and I think have a, a pretty decent game plan going forward about how I can bring him some value and then how I can become much better at tournament poker sort of quickly. So that's cool. Scheduled some Facebook. The tax thing is a bonus, hell yeah. That's a bonus. Awesome day. Super pumped, um, and hopefully we hit it again tomorrow. But until then, 